Hello everybody, welcome back to Psychonauts in the last episode. We kind of figured out who the milkman was and we got into the asylum. There's only one problem with it. He immediately tries to burn down the asylum. This is... This is weird. Whoa, portal. Okay, fine, I'll walk through it. Wait, what? What's happening? Okay. Just yes. You see, that's how you make enemies right there. You say dumb things like that. So now let's get more figments. Because I'm guessing each set has their own figments since we just swapped between them. So how do we even mess with the mood override? Mm. Wait, what? Even here, molester hints are after me. Man. Oh, what's off to the... Hello, suitcase. I have your tag for you. Yeah, destroy everything. We must go see Gloria again. What happened? Uh, get out of here. Sorry. It was just in my way. Now you see, that performance is exactly why we need to practice. Beta kid, I'm through. As long as Jasper and that phantom are out there, I'm staying back here, wallowing in my glamorous torment. Uh, but the show must go the show on. must go on. Yeah, it must go on without me. As long as Jasper rolls and that phantom are out there. Sorry, kid. You're wow. You're scared of that phantom, are you? No, it's not him I'm frightened of. It's that fat one who clings to the side of the theater like a blood-swollen tick sucking out its life. Ew. He's always been there, but he wasn't always that big and loud. I couldn't hear him much at all, really, until Gloria's mother hit the stage. He didn't like her performance either? No, I mean hit the stage, curse splat, jump from the catwalks while Gloria was in Paris. Yeah, that's what the janitor said, too. I'll leave you alone now. I know you have a lot of crying to do. Yeah. So Gloria's mother died by falling off the stage. And I'm guessing that's what caused the appearance of the phantom. I'm still not touching that water again. Molester hands are too scary. Even in cardboard form. So how do I get up there? Do I like... Okay, fine. I'll talk to some other useful person. You said that if Benita performed, everything would be okay. Okay, so I left out the part about the deadly phantom. I thought you'd chicken out. Ma'am, I'm a psychonaut. Just show me how to get up to those catwalks and hides out in and... Sorry, no way up there. Well, there was this one place. We would lower this prop hot air balloon down from the catwalk and then pull it back up again. If you find it, or any other place for crying out loud, just bring it to me. Run the actors through it. We're so desperate for new material around here. Okay. So we need a fine place. This guy said he had a play of mine. Woo, we got the purse. I didn't even know we had a purse tag. Okay, so all we have to do is talk to you. Hey, can you help me get up to the catwalk so I can fight that phantom? Ah! Can't get there from here. <laughs> I mean, unless you did that one particular play. 
on that one particular set. Oh, but what am I saying? That's almost impossible. Forget about it. The theater is doomed. Why do I feel like he's the Phantom? I really do feel like he's the Phantom. Hey, why do you have to be so hard on Benita? I'm trying to save you from that mysterious Phantom character. He only attacks when Bonita performs. If we got rid of Little Miss Sunshine, we'd all be safer now, wouldn't we? I'm only thinking of the children. Children? What children? Besides the one I punched in the face on stage. Benita's just trying to lighten things up around here. Ah! I've seen better shines on a shoe. She should quit now while she can still get a job as a nightlight. You're very mean for no reason whatsoever. Those devil horns aren't for nothing, I guess. If you can't say something nice, don't say anything at all. The young boy's protests, though heartfelt, quickly lapsed into simplistic and tedious platitudes. One and a half stars. Well, you need to shut your mouth in general. You hate the show so much. Why don't you just leave? Oh, I can't stop looking at it. It's like the sight of a horrible car act. A car accident where the victims can't act and the paramedics forget their lives. All right, later, you old gas bag. Listen, this play just stinks. Here, try this one instead. This play has some action in it, some zing. Wow, thanks. Are you actually being nice? No, I'm just trying to keep myself halfway entertained. Go, give that to Becky and see if she can't find some actors to ruin it. So what's this play about? Okay. So hey, I found a play. Hey, what's this? A new script? Night of Joy. Weird. Smells like popcorn and it doesn't say which set to play it on. Oh well, we'll just play it on whatever's on stage. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? A lot can. Here. You can be my first AD. Use the megaphone if you want to run the play again. Okay, new script, everybody. Let's practice. And action. Well, this could be a train wreck and a half. Let's sit back and watch as everything goes down. So I'm guessing this is the wrong stage. So through the portal. Woo, different stage time. I like how they just get hosted up from out of nowhere as well. So Um, what exactly is this? Huzzah, forsooth! What is thine sweet smell in the air? Let us spin and be happy, entwined in this pole of love, forever young and twisty! Rejoice, for spring has beset in upon ourselves, and the spirit of men This is so cringeworthy. Can we just play Night of Joy? Um, that still didn't seem right. 
I'll collect the figments while I'm here. But I think we need a mood change. So I'm going to do the one thing Raz is known for. Go up and just punch it. That may work. That's how you interact with every other object. That or maybe I just have to hit Y. Y does it trick. Fine. I do have to punch it. Y does nothing. Ooh. What? What? <laughs> Welcome to Hagatha Home School for Girls, where you will begin your long and painful training in the theatrical discipline. <laughs> but I don't want to study theater! I want my mom to come take it home right now! Your mom has a career and a boyfriend to think about. She doesn't have time for an ugly little girl like you. Boo hoo hoo hoo! There is nothing more tedious than the tears of an unlovable child it's time to suffer for your art okay so it does tell us well we're gonna come down here oh 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 snap good Yeah, I'll punch the dog as well. Stop trying to attack me for no reason. I did nothing wrong. I came down here so I could tell you all what roles you're playing in what play. Sheesh. So, let me see if I can do it. Wait. Trapeze? Okay, let me stunt on him real quick. And swap around. Swap around. Yeah, we need to go this way, Raz. You're swinging backwards. And swap around. I I don't know what's happening. He kept stopping in mid segments. Hey, there's the hot air balloon I need to get to the catwalks. Now, if I could just get them to do a play that brings it down here, I could ride it up to the catwalks and take care of that phantom. What's what stopped me from getting in? Oh, it's lightly too. Wait, what? Raz. Raz, you could probably grab onto that ledge. What's stopping you from grabbing the ledge of that than just shimmying up like you normally do? Invisible walls? Sheesh. I should have guessed the game would do something that is completely pointless. Sheesh. All I want to do is go up to the catwalk. Uh, Raz drop okay maybe I need to float down if I want to get that figment got it Ex excuse me Raz you wouldn't even let me jump even if it would have been the wrong direction it would have been something uh, no stop and this way and up again and I'm up here now let's just gently float down. You know what? That figment can stay up there. I don't care about it anymore. It literally just stopped me. So let's see what plays on this set. There's a dragon here. You have been fooled and burned. Outstanding. 
So cardboard fire is dangerous. What? I don't like that angry set. Get in a better mood. You know what? Screw this. No. Everyone here dies, okay? No one's allowed to live. Because apparently I can't trust you all. Sheesh. Wait, what? That's actual fu I thought it was like special effects that made her burn. I didn't know the fire would actually kill me. Um, I have an idea. On this play, the guy ran into the tunnel, right? Well, in that one play. So if we like use the megaphone and call for the night of joy. Yeah, he beats up the dragon. My father has nobly spoken the beast to his own death. He is a hero. Yay, hey, for the record, not a bad kisser. We didn't need to know that part. Up, oh, they're trying to attack me again. Don't worry, I'm safe up here. The day the mill boat finally came. What? Let's... Can I burn that? It looks like it's something that will be burnable. Okay. Nope. So let's just come down here. Up. Oh, nope. 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 Hey. Another script? The day the mailboat finally came? Yeah, go somewhere. And action. Don't try to kill me this time. 